What's up guys? I'm here at the Martin Luther King Park here in Rochester, Minnesota. I just want to give you guys a quick look at the Royal Rive first runs that will be dropping a week from today on the Dynamic Disc website. The numbers for this disc are 13503.5. So a lot of people have been asking me kind of where does this disc fall in line with the rest of their lineup uh, and I've just been kind of saying loosely that it, it kind of fits in between my Ballista Pro uh, and my Raider so what better way to show that to you guys than to throw all three and then get an idea of uh, the difference in flight well also after I finish throwing I'll uh, use my range finder to get exact distances just to give you an idea of how far one is from the other uh, real quick give you a little profile um, I guess you can see that it feels feels very very similar to my Raider I don't I don't know if it's gonna be a stable though we'll, we'll find out here in a second the plastic feels amazing um, and again some of the questions that I've gotten about this disc in the Royal lineup is what is the deal with them um, basically this is gonna be a premium lineup of disc being provided um, by Latitude 64. So one of the main things that I really noticed is this is a really smooth transition. Uh, they've polished all the flashing out and the plastic feels amazing. The name of this plastic they've settled on will be Grand and then the putt and approach plastic is going to be uh, called Sense. So the Faith will be coming out in a, a Sense plastic where these will be a Grand plastic. So. I think I'm gonna start off with the, the Ballista Pro and the Raider first, and then I'll save this bad boy for last. So first, Ballista Pro. Got a pretty stout tailwind out here it seems to be smacking things down i'm not really going for max distance i just want to get i'm going to throw each one of them about 70 75 percent and just get a good smooth consistent throw across the board and then we'll we'll look at distances so this is the raider shout out to pat stable probably finish a little bit shorter and then we'll finish out with the ride and I'm gonna try to throw each one of them sidearm coming back so you can get a flight uh, a look at that flight stable than I expected to be honest with you uh, I got one in the Royal box early on that was like a 173 and that sucker was flippy uh, I think I must have gotten a lemon because everybody I've talked to said that theirs were, were pretty beefy and even like in the video that Nico did a while back uh, his are pretty finishing on Heiser and you know he flexes everything over so I'm um, gonna run down there real quick and then shoot some distances and then we'll sidearm back all right there you have it. Um, <clears throat> on the way out, 380, 375, 350. So again, none of those were really trying to achieve like max distance. I just wanted to give you guys a good idea of the flight. But uh, on the way back, the sidearm, the, the ride was like the second longest, Ballista Pro was longest again. So um, yeah, I'm gonna continue to work with them. I think once I get a little bit beat up, It'll really start to flip over and carry for a while, so we'll see how it goes.